Italians are voting today for the first time since the coronavirus pandemic started in a vote that could turn back the focus on politics rather than the healthcare crisis. Italians are voting today in a referendum to confirm cutting the number of lawmakers. In seven out of 20 regions in the country, there will also be regional ballots. The main concern in this vote, of course, would be turnout. The last time Italians were called to cast their views in a referendum over constitutional reform was 2016, a vote which led to the fall of Matteo Renzi's government. In that case, turnout was 65%. Today, as we can see at my back, there is hardly any queue to get inside the polling station. Even if the job of Prime Minister Giuseppe Conte looks safe at the moment, weak results for the centre-left could lead to increased calls for a limited government reshuffle. In order to vote, Italians will have to wear a mask and sanitize their hands, but they will not be checked their temperature. Italians who are currently under quarantine restrictions will be able to vote from their homes. The vote was initially due to take place last March. At the time, though, the country was in a full lockdown to fight against a surge in the number of coronavirus cases. Today, Italy is finding itself in a better place compared to other countries like Spain or France. At the same time, the number of cases has been slowly going up in the last weeks which precludes fears that it could rise further in coming weeks after schools reopened last week.